Good evening, everyone. Piotr Bagration greets you all. Why? Because we've got a nice picture of him here. And frankly, we try to save Sean Connery for Saturday Night Fights. And it's not Saturday, it's Wednesday. And it's not just any Wednesday, it is the Wednesday before Christmas Eve. It's Christmas Eve Eve. Santa is loading the presents. He is gunning up the sleigh. He is fattening up the reindeer. Hello, John Stanley. How are you? And how are you, Valker? I'm well. Are you ready for Christmas? Absolutely. Are you ready to be surprised on Christmas morning? Very excited. All right. And tonight, because it's the thing we do, uh, we still get together on a Wednesday. It's not Christmas Eve. It's not Christmas Day. We can still get together and play some war games. Ian, how are you? Happy day before Christmas Eve. And uh, so I figured we'd come back and finish our game, I think we could finish, of Austerlitz. Unfortunately, uh, our, our guy Griffin, 2-6, and Brant can't be here. So we've called in a sub, and what an appropriate sub. A man who is well familiar with the despair of French arms and desperate situations for the oh, Emperor. wow. <laughs> <laughs> it's our guy Dalinar. How are you, Ron? Very well, thank you. Merry Christmas, all. Ho, <laughs> ho, ho. We also are bringing back our crack allied team. They're all back. We're very, very happy to help have them back. Not only do we have Velker, but we have Mike, OJ's dad. How are you, Mike? I'm good. Good to have you here. And all the way from over the other side of the briny, where apparently everybody has to live in a three foot by three foot closet. I feel so desperately bad for all my friends there. We have David Pumphouse. Good evening. How are you? Absolutely super. <laughs> Do they have you locked in a very small room? Um, not, not, uh, not, not too dissimilar. Not too dissimilar. Um, yeah. Um, but yeah, it's it's yeah, it's a bit dicey over in uh, Britain at the moment. A bit yeah. dicey. And I oh, and I, you know what? That's a good point. Uh, Ian is pointing out it is actually Christmas Eve where you are. So, uh, nice. so uh, that's right. That's right. Happy. Christmas Eve, my goodness. We have right. Christmas Eve. Any? Do you have any chance of snow over there? Any chance? No, any chance? no, no, no chance at all. I don't think. Maybe in Scotland, but uh, not not as south as I am. Yeah, yeah. Because right, you're in you're in tier four, aren't you? I am. I am indeed. <laughs> yeah. I just, just that just clicked with me. Because yeah, Ian is Ian, Christmas yeah, Ian pretty is, much Ian got cancelled. <laughs> yeah, Ian is. Yeah. Ian is hiding out way up in the north, so he's he's avoiding the very worst. Oh, it's just dreadful. But no, yeah, we're we're yeah. The thing is, you live in Wisconsin here in the Middle West, in Milwaukee, in the American Middle West, and it is desperately cold throughout the winter, really pretty much September to May. And the one thing you hope for is a white Christmas, and we have zero chance. No chance. Yeah, they keep pushing our chances. This weekend we were like guaranteed a white Christmas, and like the last three weather forecasts new cycles they keep moving it further and further to the east east oh. so it's yeah we're supposed to get heavy rain starting tomorrow here in jersey yeah we're supposed to get the rain hey red we are supposed to get the rain and it's and we're well we're when we wake up tomorrow we're going to have wind chills at or about zero but no snow yeah we're getting, the rain right, we're getting the rain right now oh yeah we are too so it's so it's good to be indoors. That's where we should be. We should be indoors, playing games with our friends, being with our friends, reminding ourselves that one 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 day we will have human contact again, and play some Austerlitz. Well, because Brant and uh, Griff couldn't be here, I will step in to subordinate my command to Ron's. Ron, so you know, you've got this whole area up here in the north. Every French dude up here in the north. The only thing I've got under my command down here is these two brigades of the reserve division. That's me. Every other okay. fr every other French guy is you. So, uh, and then I'm of course all these fellas that are in a pretty desperate predicament down here. But hey, Ron, did go ahead. Ron, did I just hear Jim admit that he's caused this mess? I have had nothing to do with this game. I have not played. Oh, okay. No, no, he did not say he did. <laughs> That is good. <laughs> I heard. I heard him was. I heard he was turning over overall command to you because he created this mess. Well, that's. Uh, so now I gotta. Why you gotta be? You know, Mike. You know, I, I missed you, and now, I'm, now suddenly I'm not missing you. I, I don't understand. <laughs> 
the uh, I, I don't understand what's going on here. That is so, so I'm gonna turn this down real quick. Who's sending me notices? Why is that happening right now? Oh, it's telling me that I'm broadcasting. Thank you, YouTube. Yes. Oh goodness. So now, to Twitter. That's right. That's where I am right now, my friend. Uh, I'm going out of here. Job, to, to, thanks, man. It's it is it's my fault, Ron. I was harassing him. That is true. Had him all flustered. I noticed uh, Velker didn't didn't dispute my my uh, statement though. Yeah, kind of agreed with it. I think. Not not, not likely that a son is going to dispute such a remark about his dad. I'll say. Uh, <laughs> it's it's. Um, and, so, and, and, and he's not even a teenager yet. No, no, not not soon. Not quite, not until soon, April. soon. Um, but we're going to look down. And we're going to notice. Like I said, it's turn twenty-two. But we've also got a situation with the morales. The French morale has dipped to seven to seven and the and the allied morale i happen to know because i went over there before is nine seven to nine that's dramatic but i must now ask will my friends the allies please give napoleon dalinor some mo dice so that we can start our turn 22 here we go go on mike velker has got it got oh, oh Velka. there he's we go good. we got mo dice yep all right ron you're up Yep, looking over the situation here as I see cavalry mixed in, enemy cavalry mixed in with my infantry. Oh yeah, th that that was the dramatic ending of our last battle. Velker coming screaming off the Pratzen Heights and just jumping on some of our fellows. And actually causing a couple kills, I think. Yeah, I think I got two kills off of him. Maybe one. Ooh, these guys are scattered out. Okay. Um... Now remember, in this game, you also have Napoleon's thing. Oh, wonderful. So ah, you, Napoleon's thing. So you want to give somebody Napoleon's thing because uh, because of good staff work, whoever you order first, that only costs two mo dice, two mo points. Right. <laughs> Tommy, good to see you. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. When it comes to playing American football, we will bring whoever it may be up and into Lambeau Field. Let's get that done for a fact. Just just remember, the SCC will not travel north of the Mason-Dixon line. I hear that there's rules on that. First. Yeah. <laughs> All right. All right, so you're going to fire up uh, the first corps? Yep. All right, away you go. Is this actually first court right here, too, or is that just... It is. Okay. We prepare them. I don't know what good that'll do. I guess you never know. Garrison these guys. Done. That's different. And we'll move, actually move these guys. Hey, while, while Ron's going, I don't know if everybody saw this, but uh, Wargame Vault started their Christmas sale. Oh, nice. Yes, did see that. The tiles. Anything, so. anything, uh, anything particularly worth mentioning? Honestly, I haven't had a chance really to look all that hard. I think the few things that I would probably want to pick up is I probably got to go to um, another site for mm. um, big, big, uh, bloody big battles and uh, snappy nappy. Oh, there you go. Yeah, um, yeah. I don't think either one of those are available. They're, they're not. Both, it's a, but... it, both of those are, are very strange, and I've talked to both the authors about that. I own both rules. I like both rules, but it's still still a thing all right so you got uh three there ron but you're gonna get three for the price of two yeah and i'm gonna prepare him let's just make it just in case this guy in front of me okay, just in case he's got ideas yep so those four so that'd be for two two all right i'm over here good lord what have you done <laughs> you know i saw that too i was like oh I 
Ah. <laughs> I just looked at his Alon. Yeah. <laughs> it not good. Yeah, they're a bit beat up, aren't they? Oh. All three of those units are pretty beat up right now. Ooh. Hey, Jim, just, I'm sorry, real quick. Yeah. Do I have to leave a unit back here in town to maintain it, or I can move out of t everybody out of town as long as you don't reoccupy it? You've got to hold it. There's, okay, there's, thank you. You know, because, well, i got I, I to look at that. I, I'll, look I, at what, I, I'll look at what the briefing says. I'm good with the rule either way. I just want to know. Yeah, no, so that's, I, a, I that's can... an excellent question. Let's see here. Yeah, you have to hold it. You do have to hold it. Okay, that's fine. Like I said, some rule sets will say that no, just yeah, the last, the last one in, right? And, and, and you know, commands and, and colors, for example, has a, a garrisoning rule. Yep. You are, you know, Velker. You are a stinker. Yeah, I think I gotta be sober about this. Davu's going with him because Davu is vigorous. So which means I get to cut, Yes. I get to cut this all to two. Did you round up or down? It's rounding up. You forced a retreat there. I, I, that's I would like to regard it as a redeployment in force. Thank you. <laughs> Just a reforger. Three inches is not very far. Not when you're running, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's never, it's always at least only half as far as you want it to be. All right, that's three core. That's everybody in three core. Those those guys are four core. I got nobody else over here. Are you joking? Ugh. So that's two. Uh, that's half. So up two. Yeah. So that's four. Can we keep going at four? Yes, you may. You're up, Ron. Well, you had five dice, so. Well, that's true. And by the way, Ron, notice how weird this feels. That suddenly you get to move again, as opposed to Leipzig. Yeah, you know. And the map is so small, we actually can get across without having to try and find something. I know, it's teeny. The map is teeny. Alright, let's throw this cavalry. Alright. Cavalry reserve it is. We're going for the Cossacks, of course. Bonk, sure. Hello, Cossack people. Nice pull, Hello, Cossacks. Cossack people. Things. Dirty things. Very bad things. They touched They're us Cossacks. How much could they really do? <laughs> they could smell in my area. Alright, that's two. I'm going to take a total of six down here. Dealt with this. That's fine. Oh, this was another joke show. Um... Still in all. Yeah. Hey, Jim, I know. I was looking. Dragoons. I was looking at that too. Hey What's that? Jim, just as a reminder, those dragoons I had you rename. Mm -hmm. Those are French units, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah, they are. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yep. Okay. Okay. I, plans, I just realized I, oh, that. I have plans for them, but I got I got things I got to deal with here. <gasps> no, no, no. That's fine. I just I just realized that that yeah. they were French oh, units. Do I really want to do that though? I wind up getting him killed. Yeah, I'm looking at this too. I'm just. Uh, uh, all right. Yeah, I was gonna say I don't know if you want to do it with that one. He's get we're low as it is, and you got two others that are down there that are just as low. Fortune favors the hold. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's just not the way it's worked out. Um... Right. 
we had four. Ron moved two. I just moved three, so that the five, nine. Can we keep going? Nine. Yes, you may keep going. Ron. All right. Activating the guard. All right. I do want to do this. <laughs> Saucy. Okay. Got it. Just want to make sure they knew who was on top. Oh yeah. Ten. Hold on here. Ah, what the heck? That would be two. It's 11. Let's shoot down here now. Let's get this nonsense sorted. My wife bought me hot cocoa with marshmallows. Uh, don't get much more Christmas than that. No siree. She made home, homemade eggnog today with rum for the week, for the Christmas. Ooh. And it's only me and her and the kids. <laughs> rum is good. Well, that's how you get the kids to bed early on Christmas Eve. Oh, man. That's 11. Yeah, you try to get a 16-year-old to bed early. Oh, that way. That's no 12. car keys for you. Get to bed. That's all I got. 13. How about now? Can we keep going? Yes. Yes, you may. Over to you, Ron. Okay, a little thinking here. It has to go individual. All right. All right, we're going to get saucy. Here we go. Yeah, I knew him. that was coming. Taking, he's taking morale with him. Oh, oh yeah. Let's taking see. him with him. All right. So it's 15. How about me? What do I got? I've already done my saucy things, I think. I forget you have two reserve guys down here, yeah. too. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Are not going to try to charge? Oh, I had no chance. I think so? No. All right. Oh, if, believe me, I would have tried if I thought I could. That's, you want to look at it? Because I think you can. All right. I think you can. I'll take a peek at it. I won't say no. So you're facing the same way as these guys. Yep. Right? You show me three clicks. Oh. <laughs> Uh, no, because your center is not going to be involved into the base. I think it is. And they have to start out up. They have to start out up forty-five degrees. No, you can. Go turn where you were. No, and they also have to be in visual range of forty-five in your forty-five front. That's true. That's right. Is that a thing? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's it's, and I was further forward than that. That was the real problem. I was actually further forward. So I'm more than happy to do this. Which does Trust me, if you could take it, I'd tell you to, but... Yeah, no, I probably would have taken it first, frankly, just to make sure I didn't screw it up. Um, but that said, that takes us to... That was 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, because we did... I did two, and he did a single, so that's four. 17, how are we doing? You may continue. Ryan, you're up.
Got the fit like scattered all over the place. Mm. All right, you know what? Let's uh prepare him. Nineteen, my turn. I really should. Breath, Brant, if you ever listen to this, you really put us in a predicament. <laughs> this is a spot, man. We're in a spot. We're in a tight spot. What? He's got he's got three units of dragoons running around our rear. Ooh, that sounds kinky. <laughs> you don't know Brant well enough. <laughs> True. He was he was armor. That's true. Tank boy. Um, yeah, he'll go over there. That'll take us to 21. How about now? You're done. We're done. All right. I All right. Got, I, I know for a fact I have no guns. I think you might still have some left. Yeah, I got one here. You want to shoot that gun? Yes, sir. We'll try it over here. That, that'll be it for it. Oh, uh, Ian Jackson's getting excited. He's finding. He's looking for a spade. Two with a bonus because of Mara. Oh, Got one. That. that I'm always good with artillery. It comes to everything else. Everything. Well, you know what, though? Got, got to be good at something. You got this gun. Mm. I don't know. No, he's in my way. No one else is. No. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Is that it? All right. How about over here for musketry? I suspect you've got some. Prepared guy here. Yeah, this guy and this guy right here first. I'll try this one first. And it's over here at the Cossacks. Yep. Do you get a disadvantage? Should you be... get a disadvantage for firing a horse, right? I, get, I don't get skirmishers. Right, that's that's it. So it's four, four no bonus. Is that in range? I'd say. I'd say exactly. And they should be. They bounced off of them. Yeah, I think that's the point. Yeah. Three no bonus. Nope. Ooh. Seven no bonus. Can you see me up down that hill? Yes. Like, I'm just barely on. Okay. Yep. Yeah, because you're halfway off the hell, yeah. yeah. Seven, no bonus. Ah, oh, oh, come wow. on. Wow. Oh. Oh. That's a barrel of nothing. nothing yeah. There. I don't think you have anyone. Can't shoot there. I doubt it. Um, just because I spent the whole turn backing away from you. Uh, yeah, that's it. All right, melees starting over here, I guess. Yeah, I've. If you lose this. I know, right? I've got uh, four, five, but I'm undersized four, so it is a four. Versus you are a. You are a. Three. You're a three, but you got to reroll all hits. Yes. And he's in the river, right? That's why he's at three. Oh, I didn't see the four. I'm sorry, I just saw three. Yeah, so I saw hands over it. That's why. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's uh, four to three, but you reroll all hits. One. I ain't no Brant. No, I'm not. Yeah. Woohoo! That'll be a kill anyway. No matter what happens, that's a yeah. kill. No, I'll be. Oh, is it? Oh, yeah, it is. Yeah, he has only three ammo yeah. left. Yep. Had I had I managed to roll it off, I would have. Survive. Yeah. But all right, so that's an advance for me. Don't call it a comeback. Do you really want to, though? I've been here for years. Do you want to advance? Yeah, I don't. No. So if I can get the French to please decrement their morale, taking them to eight, bringing it closer to a tie, or the uh, the Allies. What am I saying? I was gonna say, wait a minute. Well, hey, no, we did well that <laughs> we're, time. We're... Yeah, we're at eight. Yeah, good. All right, what you got? Hey, Velker, what units am I commanding this time? 
All right, we got this one here. We have the guard, grenadiers. There's the second brigade. Yeah, so that's four. No bonus for that. So it's you got seven. Seven to four. Uh, the way we broke it up before was we gave basically this area of the. That's true. You're raising a good point, Mike. Uh, that David was commanding all these guys kind of in here. Most of the guys right. all the way to the hill. Velker had all these guys that have come crashing down into the center. And OJ, you got everybody mm -hmm. over here. So I'll keep these guys. Okay. You can have the center. Dave will keep the right. Did you, where, where, do you wanna, where, where, where did you want to be, Velker? Okay. I'll be on the left. Oh, you're going you're gonna to go back here to the left? Yeah. Okay. To keep chasing me around the mulberry bush. Uh, yeah. All right. So then these guys in the center would probably be OJs. Yep. So, right. th so this is again seven to four. <gasps> oh, all seven. Wow. Wow. I don't think I've seen it. I don't think I've seen it. Magic. Oh, that's not good. And OJ, you got to come up with a, with four dice. Oh, I'm sorry. Mm hmm. Three. Uh, That's a kill. Difference of four is a kill. Yep. And now. Morale... Oh my god! Can I do this good at freaking Leip Leipzig? Morale is tied. You're you gonna have... use up all your good rolls tonight. You <laughs> if you, you wish. You, you have fallen into our trap. <laughs> into your cunning trap. Three inches. There's another melee. I think. Yep, right here. That's six. To one, holy cow! That's not fair. And the one rerolls all hits because that is a flank shot. Clearly, six to one. You got this. Thing. Nope. Ugh. nope. One. No nothing. Okay. Whoa. No. Whoa. Uh, Never that, work harder than you have to. I've, that is true. That may be the best example of that that I've seen. That um, drops the allied morale again. You may advance if you wish. Down to six. So it's seven to six, or. Eight. Yep, seven to six. Seven to six. No playing around out there now, kids. All right, Ron, you got another shot. Now, this one was bold. This is a five because of the shock and a six because of Marah. Uh, Marah comes in. This is a seven. Seven. But they re-roll. And they have to re-roll. So it's six to seven, but the allies must re-roll all hits. Sorry, I missed that. That was a total lag. I lagged for a second. It's like it should be seven to seven, right? No, it's six. You've got a you've got a base morale of four, plus one for shock, plus one for morale. Six, for morale. Huh? So how bad are you guys sucking? <laughs> yeah. Thanks, hon. <laughs> Sorry, my 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 sound was lagging for a second, so I didn't actually catch the whole thing. Yeah. So it's uh yeah you got six. Four. How many did you roll, David? Five. Roll, David. Five. You rolled five. You rolled so five. Uh, uh, he's now got to roll. No, he's got to re-roll. Yeah, oh, that's, got to right. re -roll. Oh, that's right. Yeah. So I just re-rolled the five, right? Correct. Ooh, that'll do. Two. All right. So that was four to two, correct? Yep. So right. Correct. Yeah. They still bounce, though. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So weird. Nope. S.A. It's a great rule. I do have to decrement their morale by one. Six inches straight back, facing the same way. And now, roll 1d6 for Marah. Do not roll a six. Do roll a six. Do, do. <laughs> Oh, no! Ian Hamilton! Ian! Hamilton. Ian. Oh, it paid off! Hurrah! Hurrah oh, Joachim does Lost not make it. Austerlitz. Dies at no! The, the history of Italy is different. Oh my goodness. <laughs> that's a, that is... Yeah, that's a definite raspberry right there. That, yeah, it is.
Was that? I don't old, think Naples that will old? mourn him too much, though. No, well, they have nice statuary, though. They do. Now, is that a morale decrement for it's, the it's not. French? It's not. Okay. It, it is. It is, however, a leader. Yeah, it's not like Cam Cran in colors. <laughs> yeah, but it, it is. No, a, no, and that's fine. I. No, we we so question. seldom have well, killed I, a commander yeah, here. I don't think, I don't think oh, no, really? Seen, yeah. I don't think we've ever seen it. Yeah. Um, so e. A... Jackson, you just made his Christmas. <laughs> yeah. Merry Christmas, Ian. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I like your comment, Mike. Please collect Marah. <laughs> <laughs> nice, Mike. That's a, that's a clean up on aisle three. Um, how to try it though? How to use them? Oh no! And it, it turned out that that who knows that dice shoot that was a good roll. All right, I think that's it. I, I think that's all. Th these are going to be quick turns yeah. now because holy cow! Uh, so that takes us to turn twenty three. Um, and I'll let you do the honors. They get four mo dice. <laughs> All right. So, gentlemen, you get, uh, you may move. Belka, you go first. Very well. So these guys are different, right? These two? That's left wing. No, they're both left wing. Okay. They're, they're fine. Very good. In that case, this guy mm -hmm. is going to turn just a little bit and go this way. Just to... Nothing I could have done. Got it? No, so, nothing. Blame Brant. I do. Oh, I do. Brant, you're br you're Brant, you are blamed. All right, and this guy will activate. So, so it's two? Activate. All right. Yeah. Two to either Mike or David. Off to you, Mike. All right. Oakwood left me a bigger mess and Brant left you. No wonder ah. he didn't want to ah, say that more. Well, I think it was my cavalry charge that really kind of messed it up, but um, I don't think it All was right. necessarily right. Velker's fault. Got to go with a single unit activation. Velkerheim gets this another cavalry. I can come. Yeah. Then he can move what after he does a one eighty? Twelve, as long Six. as he's straight ahead. That's a We said right. Twelve. We ain't going horses. Why do horses go away? We come to play with horses. We left you some uh, presents behind. Oh, very good. And that had to be a single unit activation because he was too far away from anybody else to activate. All right. So that was uh, two for Velker, two for Mike, two over to you. So four over to you, David. Okay, dokie. Um, this, uh, second heavy cavalry division, are they up the hill a bit or are they kind of, they're on, that hill. They're on that hill. Yeah. They're over half. Yeah. We're charging. We're charging them. So you said that that can't. Yeah, because no, no LOS. The oh, artillery was in the way. I think you could see him. I was looking at it. Even with the artillery in the way. Line of sight is just got. Uh, well, you know, the unit should account for line of sight when charging. Yeah, no, I know. Makes that. a good point. Yeah. No, I know. yeah. Yeah, you know what? These guys are literally base to base. I was surprised at that. So no, that's that's a good point. No, that's that's fair enough. Point. Sorry, David. No, oh, no, that's all right. Um, all right. I think the only thing we have to can do then is maybe try and rally these guys. They are too close to the enemy. Chris, they're gonna get shot in the face by artillery. They're too close. They must, oh, they right. must be, okay. They must, they, must, they must be six inches away. Uh-oh. Oh. He's been having trouble. He is trouble. Oh, yeah. Talking about having trouble. 
<laughs> okay then. Um, oh, I guess we'll just have to prepare these guys, and um, I think these guys need to uh, rally as well. Then. Well, that's uh, yeah. ra that's ra uh... rallying is an independent action. Where'd you go? I'm still here. I don't know. My steam just went offline. Weird. So, um, you've got you've got a couple things. You got to kind of take it in bites. One is you can prepare these guys separately, which is certainly fine. But then that'll be it for them because you can't rally okay. except as an independent. So that's fair. So uh, that was two for you. Then here. Mike had two, and Velker had two, so that's six. I'm going to tell you, because I saw it rolled, you can keep going. Velker. All right. All right. I'll go with these guys mm -hmm. over here. Mm -hmm. These guys. Okay. Hello. Hello. Seven. Yeah. Hmm, I have a feeling they might be coming for you. Fancy hunch. Uh, mm, I cannot be seen eh, that edge, I don't know. I'm not, I'm I, I want you a little further back. If you're going to say I can't see you from here, that's fine. Eight. Nine. Nine to you, Mike. All right. All the horses are running away. They shoot horses, don't they? Yeah, they're they're they're, they're learning from the French at Leipzig. <laughs> so that's <laughs> oh, wait, wait, no, they would just va evaporate. I'm sorry, they wouldn't run away. Oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> Whoa, okay, Mikey. Nine, ten, hey, send me some I see how Saturday is gonna be. And, and help. Ten, send me some eggnog. Mike. So eleven over to you, David. Did you want to do that rally now? Um, I might actually not rally the Kamensky. I might. Can I turn around and rally? No. Or do I have to stand no. still and rally? You have to stand still. You have to stand still. Okay. Well, I'm I'm going to choose to just rally uh, the guard cav if I can. One d six. You need a three or better. And there you go. That'll do it. All right. That's thirteen. You can keep going, Velker. All right. I have an idea. I'm just going to look at it, though. I can't see him, can I? Nope. Okay. One inch. Oh, yeah. So I can't charge him unless I'm in the weeds? Correct. Ooh, that's rough. <laughs> Ian Jackson said he's, he's thinking about opening up a statue factory of Velker, Velkerheim. <laughs> hey. Oh, that's awesome. Velker's been to Valhalla, which is built just a little bit outside of Regensburg, where they built this thing that on a, it's on a bluff overlooking the Danube. It's a gorgeous site, but inside it's nothing but busts of famous Germans. So it'd be like it'd be like Velkerheim. They they need one of those busts of dead commanders. Yes. You said that's in Germany. It's uh, it's actually in Austria. Oh, no, it is Germany. What do I think? It's in Bavaria. But, but it's in Bavaria. Wasn't Valhalla Norse? The, uh, there's this incredible confusion uh, by some of the 19th century romantics about what constitutes Germanic. Ah. And a lot of Norse went to Germany anyway. Oh, yeah, sure. That's true. So basically, if you were blonde hair, fair skinned, you were considered German? Uh-huh. I don't think I have anything. I'm going to give it to the other people. You're going to pass? Yep. All right. How about you, Mike? 13 to you. All right. I'm going to activate these two cab units here. And pull Unfortunately, you're on indiv so individual, so you got to do one. Oh, that's right. Oh, I'm going to hold him there for just a second. 
Oh, yeah, that's within the radio next time. Okay, there we go. 15 over to you, David. <laughs> John Stanley says bl blame Wagner. That's, he, he, that's, that's, okay. he, he became a symptom. I'm just, I think I'm just going to have to uh, try and move these uh, Mr. Berg over here out of the way, I think. All right. Just leave him there. You know, just stop him right there. Yeah. Uh, I th I think that's all I can do, isn't it? No, you had really? you you were, no, you, had, you were owed another. I'd say point four inch right there. Of scooch, that's a technical term. Just like squeak, squeak, squeak. Mm -hmm. All right, that's seventeen. I'm gonna do a quick check, but I'm pretty sure you can keep going. Velker, are you still passing? Yep. How about you, Mike? All right, we'll pull this other cavalry unit back. I know I gotta adjust, adjust him up here. That's fine. That's nineteen over to you, David. Yes. Now we'll try and rally yes. Kamensky. All right, go right ahead. And you do. He's feeling a little better about the situation. And that's it. Congratulations. We got a got a very generous roll from the Emperor, I guess. Um, so gunfire from the allies, please. That's because he's just toying with us now. I know. I know it's own guns, so how about you, David? Looks like you got some. I do? I guess I can. Oh yeah, of course, yeah. Right, we'll go for the heavy artillery. <laughs> of course, <laughs> of course. I like, yeah. I, I, don't, I, like... I, I don't know why you wouldn't. Uh, that's five with a bonus. Especially since, especially since they've not shot. One. Here's a hit. And the other. Want to go to? Uh, they have to go here, I think, because that's inside. Yeah, that's, that's canister range. Okay. Yeah. Five we'll, for the we'll go for the. Five for the book. Five yeah, for, for that one then. Ooh, two. Ooh, that cover's not feeling good now. Yeah, that pole got mangled on that run. This one here. their last shot three no bonus nothing any other cannons sorry ah yeah ah yeah we've got got the old horse artillery there ah wasted might have scared him a little. And who's got this one? Is this one OJ's? Oh, yep. yeah. Yeah. We do have one. <clears throat> yeah, we might as well take the shot. Yep, might That's, as well take it. That is three with a bonus. You sure you don't want to go for the Billy? Uh, one hit. Barnes gets it. No. He would not have hit. Tend to want to take that bonus if you can get it. Yeah, and, and that's the reason why is, is I was looking for the bonus. Yeah. All right. That, pre Velcro, that, that prepared is what gave me the bonus, right, Jim? Correct. Correct. Yeah. Since I'm down by you, Velker, did you have any musketry? Uh, um, I don't think so. Okay. I don't can these guys not shoot out of prepared? Aren't they considered in square? Who would, they, who would they shoot, Mike? There's nobody to shoot. They can't shoot the dragoons? No, no. Okay. That's what I wasn't sure about. Is was on the prepared yes. if they were considered to have a wider nope. arc because they're considered in square versus 
Yeah, okay. Yeah, I asked that question. It's Versus sad. an actual frontage. Yeah. Okay. So we come I'm over here to you, Mike. Those guys can't shoot. I don't have anybody. Okay. How about you, David? Did you have anybody that can shoot in melee? Well, these guys can. Yeah, let's do it. That's, it's uh, only two, though. Uh, are they in range? Yeah. Well, they've got they... attached artillery. So that is, but that's going to be, so that's going to be halved. So it's going to be three, two. Yeah, you're right. Two, no bonus. Still take the shot. These fellas? Yeah, we'll, um, they gotta we can go try and shoot. Got to go here? Yeah. So that's, uh, ooh, that's nasty. Eight, no bonus. Oh, that's a lot of gunfire. Go on, give, give it a rub, Velka. Go on, do, do your old. Oh, I was, I was, I was, I was, <laughs> are you going to do it? I'm rubbing it. Here it goes. Oh, yes. One hit. Oh, better than nothing. Oof. One more, and it would have been game over. I think I think that's all it for the musketry. So all your musketry, nothing there, nothing there. How about here? That's a shot. Well, actually, no. I think they just prepared, though. I think doesn't matter. Preparing, doesn't matter. Oh. Preparing, preparing. Oh, but they're out of range. They're out of range. Just out. Jim, how are they out of range if they just did melee? <laughs> they oh, shouldn't be. Right. Yeah, they shouldn't be. Yeah, that's, they should be. I, yeah, yeah, okay. That's one of those things. I just wanted to make sure I wasn't missing something. No, you're right. They should be in range. Because they, should, they be should be exactly six inches. Well, not exactly, but they should be close to six inches back. So, with that in mind, though, uh, four, five, three, with a, three, no bonus. Nothing. Oh. All right, so that's all the musketry. Any melees? I thought I saw some. Velker, I know you you brought some. Nothing from David. Nothing from Mike. But doggone you. I got you. You caught me. Uh, you count the skip. I really... So, oh, jeez. Seven. Ouch. Seven, two, one. Uh -huh. Good. And, and I, you have to re-roll And I have one. to re-roll my one. I will now win. I will defeat your amazing odds. Seven to one. Here we go. Hit! Ha ha! I got you killed me. Four. Right, that's it. Good day to you, sir. Yeah. Good. That's the record, too. You may advance if you wish. French morale drops to six, so it's six to six. Uh, it should be, yeah. Oh, serious. Terribly, yep. terribly serious. Very scary. Um, that's it. That's everybody, I think. Did I miss anything? We're going to roll on. It is now turn 24, which, as we know, is a French turn. So if the Allies could give us some mo dice and set Napoleon on his way, I would be grateful. Did we just lose Ron again? How is it that Ron, who's in New Jersey, has got a better connection than David, who's in the middle of Kent? Why is that? Well, he doesn't seem to. He keeps dropping. Yeah, so I'm here. It's it's your turn, my friend. And don't forget. Napoleon. Yes, we got the rolls already. Yeah. Can't believe you just said I was from Kent. Oh dear, terrible. Sorry, sorry. sorry. <laughs> Activate these cavalry. Go for it. Kent? Oh. <laughs> Those Kentish people. Those Kentish people. <laughs> all, all, all Jim sees is a target for Napoleon to invade. That's that's true. That's where we were coming. It's a bunch of dirty. He just couldn't. He just couldn't get a navy built to support it. Bunch of dirty jutes, anyway. And I just might like saying jutes. Angles, Saxons, and jutes. I'm an East Saxon, technically, ah. because I'm from Essex. Ah. Right, that's so that, that's, that's why I took offense at, yeah, offense that's true. at that's uh, true. being yeah, that's called true. Kentish. That's true. Yeah. yeah. 
All right, that's All two. Right, that's two. That's two radically divided up. Very good. My turn. Where, where is my suffering? So, at? so Jim is Essex. That would be what, like the fifty-third state when we suck them back in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't know though. I, I can't. Just, I, I kind of like the way old. Can we keep the way old? I have a higher priority. I just realized it. Um, where are they? There they are. You know, it'd be great if Grant hadn't got Brant hadn't got my guns killed. That's what would be great. Activating the reserve. Um, you'll have some excuse for why that was a good thing. Right. Or is it they say adversity breeds ingenuity? You'll you'll pull it out of the bag, maybe. I like the I like that uh latterly maybe. That was great. <laughs> yeah. that's, that's super. Uh so that's two for you, two for me, that's four. Well we rolled five dice, so I'm pretty sure you can go around. All right, activating the fifth, the two fifth guys over here. <laughs> Ian Jackson says Napoleon lost to a few Welch women. We don't fear him. All right, that's three. All right, that's seven over to me. Are you bonking? Oh, yes. I need that blue hand to move so I can finish my distance. Thank you. Come on. There we go. So, yeah, this is seven, eight, nine. Ten. We still up? Give me a second. 11. Can we keep going? Yes, you may. Run. Oh, I don't know. Oh, they're prepared now. Dang it. Yeah, of course they are. You ran into them really hard last time. <laughs> I'd be disappointed if they weren't. Yeah. Uh huh. That's two more. Twelve, thirteen. My turn. Done, done. Yeah, it's all you.
Yeah, it's a little rough over there, right? One thing is, you can't charge through trees. That is true. So, uh, there, four, that's 15. Can we keep going? Yes, yes you may at 15. On. I'm not going to be able to get an angle to charge him, am I? The uh, guard grenadiers. Yeah, that would be a, that is one of the micro move ones you'd be able to get. Yes, I would defend that all day long. It just it's the product of the the less than one. Yeah, the table tuck. I was trying to. Yeah, I was like, I can line it up, but I can't. Yeah, if you scooched it just so much as a degree, yeah, no, I, I'll defend that. You should have to. You're gonna have to when you get there. You're gonna have to turn though. Fifth, I'll do. Fifth, Fifteen. Did, is he? Nah, they were too far apart. It was individuals. I was on individual anyway. Yeah, yeah. Fifteen. Seventeen. Can we keep going? Yes. Ron, you're up. All right, press artillery. Mm -hmm. That's two. Nineteen. Forgot to get a picture of this. I'm gonna pass uh, 19 over to. Uh, do we? Can we keep going? Yes, you may. Ron, 19. We're gonna rally these guys here. Oh. And no, I'm not. So that's 21. 21. How about now? Are you still passing? You are done. Yes, we are done. Okay. Any artillery? Do we have any guns left? Yes. Uh, My horse artillery. Oh, I'm trying to bait, Jim. Yeah. He's down to four. I know it's a, it divides in half by two. Two with a bonus. Or this guy. Right, or this guy. Goes fully. Which is four with a bonus. Alright, I'll go with four and bonus. Yeah. Uh, but these guys, I mean, yeah, guys each way. Nice. Take, take two with a bonus. We gotta, we gotta get in Yeah. Together. Yeah, exactly. And okay. Just cutting your ammo a little. And they gotta go down a little bit. Oh, I don't have my guy. No, yeah, you don't. You don't have the gun guy. All right. Uh, any musketry? I don't have any. I think I literally. I think I moved literally everybody. Yeah. Now all mine are out of range too. Melees. I got one. Is that it? I've got two. Where's yours? We're gonna do everything. Let's start. My first is my cavalry versus artillery. Oh, there we go. Uh, let's see here. That's a total of four versus three. The three re rolls. Four to three. Two to two. Yes. Can he re roll? He 
cannot. One. Loses by one. <clears throat> so he is driven back. Fa six inches facing the wrong way. And the other one. Oh, the RT? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. your other one? I'm going to move the cab up. Oh, okay. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, over here. Avenge morale. Stacy wants to break with That's her. right. Uh, this is 6 7. Oh, dear. Yeah, I know. <laughs> That's why I tried to get them out of the way. <laughs> Seven to one. Seven to And they have to re-roll that one. Why does he have to it doesn't matter. Because he's not prepared. Oh, no. No, he doesn't. That's it. Doesn't matter. It's a kill. So if the allies will decrement their morale, please, I have to... Dump I got them. it. And this is... You can advance. Can we do this? Uh, all right, here we go. Your turn to win. Ha! <laughs> Four, three. Eight. Eight to five. Good luck, Valker. Oh, it's Mike. Sorry. Eight to five. Oh, my God. Uh, three. Oh, three. my God. You did a Dalinor roll. Three to three. I lose. Son, I, that's amazing. Yes. That's depressing is what that is. Do you think I care? No. No. Uh, you'd be correct. Hey, Joker. Let... Look at him. Look at your dad. Get eye contact and laugh at him for me, please. <laughs> wow. <laughs> it is done. And, and and then remember, Christmas is two days away, so right. you got to apologize. That's a fresh unit too. I'm sorry, Dad. I didn't beat it. Oh, it's <laughs> those guys are amazing. Those guys are amazing. Now they they are now down to one. Anyway. They're down to one. But still, that is. They're not, they're, they're, they don't even have plenty sticks with fuzzy hats. I know. They're not all Polchenia, right? All right. So what's the morale over on the allied side? Five. We're six. Oh, boy. Turn 25. Three turns each to go. Allies ready for some mo dice. Isn't it 28? Oh, that's right. That's right. Yee. 28. We only have two turns each to go. Two turns each. Oh, we're up at 28? Yep. Oh, it goes to, 20. it goes to oh, 28. Our turn marker had... No, no, no. Oh, oh, it is it now 20. turn Sorry. 25, but the game ends on gotcha. turn 28. Yep. So, allies, you're up. Don't know sad. What's up? Right back for a moment, Jim. I got used to the treat. All right. All right. Uh... <laughs> uh, Ian Jackson points out that you are not to forget the call of loser, loser. Loser, loser. Belker. And you lost two weak guys. There you go. Yeah, no kidding. I start looking for my receipts. <laughs> hey, Reg, greetings to you. Happy, happy, happy best wishes for the season. So, uh, Valker, are you going first? Or who's going first? I, I don't know. Go, yeah, I think I'm going first. You're going to go first? Okay. I'm stuck with that roll. Right, these guys are losing two. 
Throw that in the weeds. Nope. Two. Two over to you, Mike. Two to me. All right. We're going to move the right wing around here some more. Can't go that far unless you face the other way. Oh, yeah. You can only go, what, up to six? Yeah, so you got to give up 3.3. There you go. There you go. And they're already facing. Mm-hmm. artillery here you can go nine correct yes sir okay one two three four five six to Dave yeah, total of eight over to you Dave okie dokie I'm gonna uh, move the Guard Cav, I think. Mm -hmm. I, can, I can engage them, can't I? You're facing the wrong way. You're facing. I, oh, I can't turn and engage? No, oh, no. No, you have to be no. able. No, you, you have, to be, have able. to be within the... your front 45 at the start of the turn. Oh, Jim, by the way, rule clarification. Hmm. Firing at cavalry is penalized. Half. Ah, uh, there it is. Okay. Oh no. I don't think it made a big difference. No, we both did it. So. Good point. Oh man. Okay. I think what I'm gonna have to do then is I'm gonna have to turn. Yeah, just basically turn the right the 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 right wing. I think. Now that horse artillery can move and shoot. Correct. Remind you, Dave. Remind Correct. You, Dave. Okay, okay. Um And they've only got one shot left. They've only got one. Right. Yeah. Oh, okay. I do believe. I do believe. But he does have he a. Does have oh, an yeah. open shot. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 He's got an open yeah. shot. Yeah. yeah. Um. Okay. That that'll be for for my turn then. Just just. Moving these Those these two. guys. Falker, you're up. Falker, you're up. Yeah. Alrighty. I think I'm on the singles because I don't think anyone else is in good range. Okay. Kind of sucks, but what are you gonna do? In the sky. Mm-hmm. Just don't know how you do sure, that. pick on the weak guys. Yeah, that's, 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 that's fine. That's fine. Yeah, he's a little, he's kind of lifted up. Just a little, yeah. All right, so that's two. So, got it. So that's 12. Over to you, Mike. The only thing I'm going to do is rotate these guys around just a little bit here, like that. That's two. More. 14. 
Over to you, Dave. All right. Um, I've done them. I've done them. Um, okay, I think I might have to maybe try. Ah, that's not going to work. Okay. Well, well if you move these guys, guys, he's going to mm. come after your artillery, probably. probably. Yeah. I'd almost be willing to move the willing. artillery back and let these infantry shoot into that, his grenadiers. He can't charge that artillery because he can't see them. This one? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Where's it would that take rule? him at least where two is turns. That, where is that rule run? You know offhand? Uh, give me two seconds. Yeah, I mean, I'm going to have to do something with these guys. Well, I guess I was almost wondering if you ought to just move, turn the artillery facing this way. Yeah. And then back yeah. them up, back them up, and then try to back them up a little bit. I, I think I'd rather try and get the artillery into position to do something than... Yeah, that'll do. And then these guys can hopefully fire into to to La Huin. Okay, that that'll be for my go. See, because I'm I want to tell you that I want to. Oh, I see what you did. So, how many did you move? Move. Uh, just 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 just, just the artillery. Oh, okay. And it it doesn't matter because that is it. That's all. So gunfire. Shall we start with the middle? I know Velker. Velker doesn't have it. Ah. Velker doesn't have it. This one I don't you have can't it. see this anything. One moved right. and it's facing. So that's these. This that's one these. Moved. This one moved. That one moved. How about this one? How about this one? That one didn't move. That one didn't move. I can get a shot we'll, there. We'll go get into pied cells. There. Yeah. Four with a bonus. Ooh. Fatigued. And he's got one more. So yeah, we've got the horse artillery going for the guard camps. On page 41, an active unit may charge any enemy unit that he it can see, right. in which it can reach an illegal change. Yeah, charge move. You can, you, sight isn't just out of that 45 degrees. Yeah, the charge move must be within 45. De the yellow 45 degree angles on the front corners of the all units are useful for illustration. But you can pivot for pivoting when charging. You can pivot 45 degrees before you charge. I, I'm, I'm gonna well, it says the well, it says site. It says the site first, and then you move. Like it tells you what it may charge first, and then it says the charge move. Right, but I'm not sh visibility. It's the the part that I'm not convinced of is that you can only see outside the 45, because a unit can trace visibility from its center point. A unit can see through any portion of its own footprint. Yeah, it's that 45 degree thing I don't know about. 
So you're going to make this shot, though. I know that. That. Mm -hmm. And that's three. Oh. With a bonus. Because you're inside six inches, aren't you? Oh, yeah. Yeah. So oh, it's yeah. a hit. Dave, you got to explain your avatar picture to us sometime. It's it's two girls and one cake and very one very disapproving queen. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I I recognize the queen. I recognize the two girls rolling around in cake, but <laughs> outside of that, I I was I was at a housewarming party and someone basically bought the the guy this this cake. Um, that they made and and yeah it was it was drunken antics um shall we say <laughs> I, I felt com i felt comfortable saying that yeah velker don't look girls don't have clothes on so don't look oh dear your mother would not approve so we've got um that gunfire is there any musketry i would think you guys might I don't know. Maybe. Um, maybe. I do. I know. I do. So we've got Rapinski firing into. Oh yeah. Hyde Harlan. Oh yeah. There we go. Uh, three, three, three. Three. Uh, three. Did, did you have attached artillery? That's no. Three no bonus. Ooh, Ow. lovely. Ow. That was stingy. Is that your boo -boo? That's a boo boo. That you caused a definite boo boo. Um, other musketry. How about here? Mm, we decide, well, none, I don't we think. Decide, did we decide this was in range? No, it is not. Velker, did you have any musketry? I don't believe I did. All right. As you have no musketry, let's sneak over here and do the bad thing because you're you're a bad person, is what you Yay. are. Yay. You are a bad, bad person. Um, I know, I know. So that's uh, a seven. Be down to five. You didn't oh. Six, nonetheless. Six to what? Six to one. Yes, you always roll. You always, always roll one die. And I have to re-roll it if I get a hit. Does not, ho, ho, ho. does not possibly matter. French, Ouch. French morale drops one to five. Davu hangs around here somewhere, I guess. He's got to move, and you may take the space. Nope. We have to roll to see if he survives? No. Mm -mm. Only things nope. that place him at risk do that, and he doesn't have one of those abilities. Ah, gotcha. And so he's just fine? He's... That's his space. When you figure that a hundred yards is to the inch, he's in a huge area and it's smoky and everything. He's riding away. Okay. He, he, he becomes a coward and dashes. Uh, no, he's probably going to chase. Yes, after his brigade you, you got that. You, you got that right, Velker. He's just running like a baby. <laughs> so, did you allies start any melees other than Velkers there, or are you done? No. Yeah, I think we're done. All right. Very good. It's now turn. Bum, bum, bum. 26. Three more phases, I guess we would call them, to go. Uh, this is a French phase. So if we can please get some allied modice. Did his horse artillery fire at my cavalry? It did. <clears throat> was that its last shot? It's got to leave. Oh, was that it? Oh, that was its last yeah. shot. It's got to go. Yep. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It leaves. Farewell. Good day. It Ron? did very well. You're right. Ron? All right. Going with the fifth. I think that's a good idea.
So, Jim, you were saying that that our battle here is a lot closer of a fight than what actually was. Well, no, actually, there's a there's a phase of Austerlitz that's very close. Um, okay. At the end of the day, it's a devastating defeat. But certain portions of the Russian army fight brilliantly. The fight up here is very, very tough. And in fact, Napoleon has to commit the guard to carry the day up in particularly this area near the Stare Venerati. And one of the great cavalry charges in European history happens right over here on the slopes of this little pimple. But up here, too, where Murat and Bagration and, and even Alexander charge back and forth, it's a great swirling melee. And Napoleon is gambling because what he does, he takes these guys here between, say, here and here, and he punches straight up the Pratzen. And he's hoping that he can get enough of the Russians down here, Futzen, Run, and Telnitz, that he can cut them in half and roll up these guys before these guys can do anything about it. It hangs in the balance for a while, for actually several hours. But uh, at the end of the day, yeah, devastating. It's a it's a crushing okay. defeat for Allied morale. Okay. Um, while you were talking, has put a note up on the chat. Um a subcommander is at risk if the unit to which he is attached is broken oh. or when he uses a personality that places him at risk. Hey, Hez, I didn't know you were here. First, it's great to see you. It is always a pleasure. And uh, let let me ask, Hez, um, let me ask, Hez, the 45 degrees, you can charge a unit that's outside the 45 degree arc as long as you can see it as long as there's no obstructing terrain, right? That's That's been one of our puzzles. But that does mean Davu is at risk. Oh, dear. Will it be two great French commanders killed in a single battle? Yes. yes. Fingers crossed. Here we go. Here we go. It is not. Oh. It is not. But that was that was quite the thing. More like this was dumped here. Okay, and I moved so three. Three for you? Okay. I'm gonna move mine. Yeah, I, I suppose I'll move to Vu. Yeah, I think Ian Jackson though, I think the difference was is Marat had a special ability that put him at risk. Right. That's that's why yeah, no, yeah. that initially and has not, his, not has because the unit would Yeah, has is saying there's two conditions. One is with the ability, but the other is if the unity is attached to is broken. And that is the case. That is what happened. Right. Yeah. It doesn't happen very much, but it is what happened. Yeah, I was just pointing out, though, that Ian was talking about Marat falling, but it had nothing to do with the unit. Right, 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 right. Breaking. It had to do with his special ability putting him at risk. All right. Or maybe I'm that's what Ian was saying. I what I wanted to pay attention to. See, you're distracting me. You're distracting me. You're doing your nefarious deeds. It has says the charge victim must be in four to five degree arc before charge pivots. Where does it say that? I can't find it. Cool. That'll be that's it's fine. It's fine. It makes sense. I'm not saying I really disagree with it. I just hadn't thought of it that way i suppose is what i'm saying just wanting to find the rule to just to reinforce your own knowledge right exactly i'm gonna shoot at you I'm, as can you can tell, I'm activating the fourth core. Yeah, 
Yeah, see, Jim, it's kind of confusing because the first sentence in the in the charge move, a charging unit may pivot on its center point up 45 degrees if desired, and then its charge move must be a straight line to the target. No, right. That part I get. The question is, if you're outside that arc before I turn, can I charge you? But inside... and that's what I'm saying. Though the way I read the way I read this is that you can turn up to 45 degrees first, and you can. And then, and, it, and, and you can't. But if you read the then, paragraph then, before it, though, you got to do your sight first. What you... See, we're all looking at page 41, and I understand that, but it doesn't really say that. Right. It doesn't say what, what, it does not say what has wrote. That's not an unreasonable interpretation of that, but I, it doesn't say that. An active unit may charge any enemy unit that it can see and which it can reach um, to avoid any argument or confusion. We all know that it may pivot on its center point up to 45 degrees and then its charge move is a straight line because I don't. Obviously, if it's blocked by terrain or all this other stuff, that's not what we're talking about. We're saying if they're just to the side of each other, essentially. I, I don't think it says it. I just don't. All right, got to activate somebody else. I yeah, activate and the examples aren't very good either. No, the examples are poor, all right, which is strange for Sam because usually his stuff is great. Uh, so you move three, I move two. That's five, so we're going to keep going. You. All right, moving the first. All right. Activating the first. Hooray. Well, they're not prepared anymore, are they? You can only go three. You moved across water. Yeah, I realize that. That's right. Wednesday Night Warfare here at Armchair Dragoons, otherwise known as the Blucher Channel. We discuss all things Blucher. Bear in mind, we're going to get one more move out of this. That will be three. All right, so that's eight. My turn. Yes, you may keep going. Well, it's still my turn. I would have, I would have gotten to go no matter what. Yeah, that's right. That is 10. How about now, Mike? You may continue. Yeah, you can, yeah, you can keep going. Ron, you're up. All right. Individual. Go for it. 12. Bonk. 12, it's my turn. Mm. You know how much it pains me that horses can't enter town. Can that horses can't enter town? How do you think I feel? 
I could get a lot of points that way, you know. Ron would have won Leipzig if he if his horses could attack towns. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm serious. I mean, just how much you have. You, you got a crap ton of that, horses yeah, out that's, there. That's not a lie. There is no lie there. Hello. I greet you. No, you're not allowed to pass through the enemy. Sorry. Three more. So that'd be five to the previous number, Mike. How are we doing? Uh, 15 total, I think. Mm -hmm. um, we're still good. All right, individual. Who am I, Kev? Hey, John Stanley, you're a dormant, co you're a dormant co commerce clause. <laughs> Come into my chat and use filthy language like that. <laughs> That's two. Seventeen. This, this this is pretty bad. Has is still looking. It's been what five minutes? Yeah, I know. I know. See, this is this is a gap. This I'm convinced. Yeah, this, is a gap. this is why we need Ross McGee. <laughs> oh, did you just indirectly insult Has? I don't think I can tolerate that. <laughs> well, what's Has going to do? He can't come down south of the border to to smack smack uh, Delanor around. So that's true. No, what I meant is because because Has finding it this long, he's usually right on top of it, like oh, in true. seconds. I'm gonna pass. I'm gonna pass. That's 17 back to uh, back to Mike, or back to to Ron. Mike, are we good? Yes, you are. All right. Uh, All right, moving his guard. Okay. Law talking man over there. Did kill us. Done. It's 19. Can we keep going, Mike? You, you can yes. keep going. Yes. All right. After All right. This, uh... What about them? All right. <clears throat> 21. How about now? Yes, you may continue. Ryan, you're up. I'm going to try rally these guys. Go for it. Yep. 23. How about now? Oh. Uh... Has has has, 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 has response. Has an answer. Yeah, I'm sorry. How many? You guys are where? I'm pointing. There it is. Twenty three. So, so I think I done. Is. You're done. And we're done. I was right. And it's it's not that I necessarily want to be right. It's just I think this is a case where I I didn't I didn't understand the sense of pivoting forty five degrees if you had to be inside forty five to start. There we go. Yeah, so so I'm sorry. So we agreed on what? They, Here's the they deal. Do I'm, I'm making a copy, so I'll get rid of it. If this guy is here, mm -hmm. 
outside the 45 degree arc and right. I can turn the the 45 turn. degrees to see him, I can charge him. Right. Right. Okay. It's not at the, it's not within the 45 at the start of the turn. It's can you turn at no more than 45 degrees to bring him to your front? Exactly. Correct. And I'm making that speed go away. All right. We were done. So, Ron, you got guns. I don't. What do you got? Horses? Going out, to, <coughs> going out the same place. Horses in town? All right. That's uh, two. No, two with a bonus. Nothing. And believe me, has your credit is good here. I do not have musketry, do you? Uh, I don't think I do. Or any guns. Oh, no. I got a shot. Oh, yeah. I saved this one up right there. Didn't bring it into range, but what are you going to do? Uh, four with a bonus. Has is going to go hide in the corner now, he says, and cry. <laughs> uh, yeah, baby. I'm going to shoot you. I'm going to shoot you. You sure will. They moved. Scary. Yeah. Right, we're hanging on. We stayed there, uh, and I don't think. Uh, do we get melees going, Ron? You started some. Oh, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Boop, 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 boop. He's got a three. You've got a four. Four to three. Oh boy! Come on, Ron. This is it. This is your moment. Redeem it. You got this. Two hits. One hit, sir. Four. Any Four hits. hits. That's three. That's a kill. Oh, no. Sacre bleu. Bien sûr. That, please decrement the allied morale. That should take you to four. You may advance if you wish, Ron. Well done. I think I'll stay right there. Thank you. And, uh, those I'm, those guys have been beating up people left and right. Vive l'Empereur! Vive l'Empereur! Where are we? Uh, where, did you have another? Nah, I think that was all. Whew, tense times now. It's a uh, five to four game creaking into the 27th turn. This is it. The last turn, last full turn. Four Mo Dice for the Allies. Here they come. Go ahead, Velker. Start on your side. All right. Ah, oh, jeez. I don't know what I do have. I really don't. Uh, can this guy be that guy? Sorry? Never mind. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. The answer is yes, parenthetically, but it's out of range, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm saying. Never mind. Mm -hmm. Yeah, remember, Vilker, this is our last turn, so there's no need to just move units to get him into position. Yeah, there's no, there's no maneuvering in this yeah, turn. Yeah, I know. I know. Trust me a little bit. Come on. Points are nothing, people. Points are nothing. Yeah. Hey, um, now, correct me if I'm wrong, Jim, but he can prepare this unit and still shoot. Yes, correct. I was still correct. Going to prepare that guy. All right, that's it. Okay. That's going to be, but that's going to drop you down to separate actions. Yeah. Okay, you're going to go there? Yep. Two to you, Mike. All right. <clears throat> so, based off of what we just talked about, my Dragoons here, mm -hmm. can they get 45s and hit these guys? Yep. That's, they can. That's, oh, that's, easily. That's almost a perfect example. <laughs> yep. No, no, and that's fine. I yeah. just wanted to make no, sure that's, before that's, that's I great. went and just... Okay, so there's one move. Now here's my other question. This artillery can move nine inches. If he moves nine to here, does he still have line of shot on these guys, or are these guys down off the crust? I'd roll a die on that, honestly. That's close. Okay. 
I mean, I don't care either way. I just want to know. I, I think I, I sh- what, you've also got a it, huge it, amount of hill. It depends how far you got him forward. I would say. Okay, so and the reason why Jim, the reason why it does matter is because if I don't have a shot there, I'm moving back over this way and take a shot back this way. That's sure. That's the only reason why it matters. Um, for the nine, we we'll put him. You're awful right far there. back. You're also awful far back at the crest. Okay, and I'm good with that. I. Yeah. I wasn't going to argue any semantics about it. It just uh, no, 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 no. I think make sure I, we're all on the same page before. I agree. Before I made the move. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. You should. There's two. Mm-hmm. Fortunately, the, unfortunately, these guys can't get into the charge. So, I'll leave it at two and pass to Dave. Four so to you, Dave. Four for us total. Righty, oh. Okay. Now we're going to charge with these dudes. <laughs> Come on in. The water's pretty. Oh, and what is Bjorn? What is oh, and he is inspiring. Oh, and he is inspiring. Yep. For our, my last action, we'll we'll charge the guard cav into no half, uh, into no their half, heavy cav. No half measures. Well, you got to go out with the bang, right? Yeah, yeah. All right, that's a uh, that's an independent. So that's six. You can keep going, Velker. I'm going to pass. To you, Mike. I'm going to do -do -do these two units with each other. Okay. Realizing that neither of them will be prepared. Yes. Okay. That's fine. Ah, but you were on individuals. Unless you wanted to pay another uh, point. Unless you wanted wait a minute. When, when, when did, wait, wait, wait. When did I go to individuals? When you went, you only moved the one guy, the gun. No, I, I moved oh, these guys. Oh, of course guys. you did. Of course you did. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. So six, I'll seven, say. eight. <laughs> seven, got it. Did I go to individuals and I forgot about it already? I sure didn't. Which is quite possible. Huh. <laughs> okay. All right, Dave. That's eight, eight, over you, eight over you, Dave. Uh, I'm just going to prepare Kamensky, I suppose. All right. Just in case that melee goes badly. <laughs> <laughs> you never know, right? He's standing over there going, <laughs> he's standing over Let's Let's see how it goes. Prepare, guys, prepare. <laughs> Ten. Velker, are you still passing? I'm still passing. Mike, ten to you. I think I think I'm going to pass. Dave, ten to you. Um, I I I guess we can. I guess we can try and meet these guys. Rally. Oh, you're not. Got it. Uh-huh. A charge is only, what, 12 inches? 12 inches. For horses. Yeah, but they can't For see them. They can't yeah. see them. Right. Oh, I was asking about another another right. unit. That'll do. That'd be 12. You can keep going, Mike. You got, or uh, Velker or Mike, you got anything? I'm still skipping. I'm skipping. Dave? I, I have nothing really much else to, to move. All right. Uh, other than, All right. yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Nothing sure. nothing else can move. All right. You got guns, though. You want to shoot them? Bet you do. You of can. course. Where do you want to start? Um, I'll go ahead and start with my horse artillery here real quick. Shoot over there. We'll go against the... Uh, 
Yeah, might as well. That's it. That's his last shot. So it is three with a bonus. No sense taking any of that can't all that powder all the uh, way home. Got a hit. Sure did. How about here? Um, you know what? I'm going to start with with, with this one first, Anything and I'm going to like. shoot like. Pied Souls. That is going to be three with a bonus. Uh -oh. Wish me luck. Uh oh. I don't. Yep. Oh, yep. Got him. Yep. Yes. yes. The guard dies. That's rough. Good shot, though. Good shot. Yeah. So now, now we'll do that cannon into into these guards. Five. Is that, is that five? five bonus. Are you sure? Are you sure? Are you sure you didn't take away the number before? I don't know. Okay, we'll go five. Yeah, he's got he's got two fives. He gets two fives. Uh, he gets two fives. Okay. Ah. Uh, Not both. That could have been brutal. No more guns. Uh, no. no. All right, Velker, I don't think you had any mu or do you have muskets? I think I do. You do. That's who do you want to shoot at? You got lots of targets. That guy right there, I think it's got to be him. He's going to be the closest, I think. Yeah. So that's uh, seven, four, no bonus. One hit. You suck. Not. Not happy about that. Ha. Ha. Got, got him. Got him. Anything, 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 nothing? How about you, Mike? You got any? Yes, you do. Yep, I got musket shooting right That fella right there, yep. Has to go, to, has yep. go against him because the other one's in melee. Uh, what's that range looking like? It's outside. I made sure of that. Good. <laughs> Four, no bonus. Four, no bonus. Miss, 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 miss. One hit. Ah, shut my mouth. Really hate that. <laughs> <laughs> shot really want to and that's a melee this dragoon melee. Yep. any other musketry oh yeah yeah there's there's no other musketry i don't think all right all right david melees although david, hang on melees we'll although hang on we're, we're, we, 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 we could we're, have we're the third yeah. shoot the second if they're yeah. up the hill oh yeah yeah oh, yeah. Yeah, go ahead. yeah go ahead <laughs> let's uh let's check some range real quick please yeah, that's uh, volley and skirmish. So for huh, interesting. No, but I'm so used to seeing skirmishers there. Two no bonus. Ooh, that. nice. nice. <laughs> nice. All right. Now those melees, David. <laughs> Yeah, we've got a big and bold. Big and bold. Bagratian going in there. French roll five. five. Russians roll three. Three to five. Two hits. Ugh. Three hits. Three hits. So, that's He's so. dead. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, dear. <laughs> Uh, and that does require Bagration to take a check. 1d6, please. Don't roll a 6. Uh-oh, can we get to... Not another big name. Nope. Not another big name. He's fine, he's fine, he's fine. So close. So that is, however, a decrement to the Allied Morale. What is the Allied Morale now? Yes. Their dishes can still make it to the table. Down to 3. Uh-oh. Well, let's see what we got. Other melees. Yeah, I got a... I gotta apologize to my fellow commanders. I should have uh, advanced this unit up here in the melee, but I'll try to put a block on uh, Jim from advancing. Think oh. about that in time. Uh, so I. So. Uh, yeah, I got a melee here with the dragoons. So five. And those dragoons got a ooh, they got a seven, five to seven, but the seven rerolls all hits. 
I'm You've the got seven. the seven, right, Jim? Yeah, I do. Yep. That's what I thought. One, two, three, four for me. <sighs> Ouch. Hey, when did the Dalinor dice take over? Now I gotta reroll. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> They both come through. So you rolled four, Mike? Yes. All right, so obviously I lose. I take two. Well, you did what I was afraid you would do, which is even if you didn't win, you nicked me up for my last big push. And so you must take one, not that it matters. And you go back six inches facing the correct way. That's fine. It seems like my my luck's changed, but then I gave it back to you. Gave me that. Oh, that was rough. That could have come out a lot better. Yeah, I boogered up. I should have taken this brigade here and moved him like right up into here, not giving you a clear charge into the city with those two heavy units. Oh yeah, that's what's coming. Yep. Um, any melees? Any left? Any left? Gentlemen, if I could request mo dice for the last turn, this is kind of exciting. With, Go ahead, Velker. It's uh, what? Four, is it really four to four? On a, on yeah. four to three. Four to three. Got it. Unless you guys kill yourselves on us losing. Well, but if we don't break your morale, it's just a slight win. It's not a win-win. Uh, Marginal victory. Marginal victory. Yeah. Marginal victory. We got those dice. Yep. Napoleon, lead us to victory. Do it. All right. All right. Taking the fifth. Mm -hmm. This is where that one degree thing is still a pain in the neck. I don't know. I, no, because you've got to go straight, and you still got to turn. And the turn is the turn in this instance. I just pivot yourself flat. Make yourself flat. Make yourself flat. We know where you're going. Because I just want to see if you hit him, and you don't. It's legit. That's legit. It's nasty, but it's legit. All right, that's f that's five core. How about this guy? Is he stand? He might as well. He can't get. Yeah, he can't do anything for this round. Yeah. Fight. I'm not fooling around with anything else. Reserve, please. Hi. Hi. I'll have enough. That's two, four, so we can keep going. Well, this one, this one, you automatically won because I'm down to I'm broken anyways, almost. So, well, you always roll one die. Right? No, no. I'm just saying though. Uh, right. Don't, don't, don't you try your negative mojo on me. Negative mojo. <laughs> you hear me, Orwick? Don't even negative try. Mojo. Nope. 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 I can't hear. I can eh? screw. I can screw that up. You just watch. Um. No Ron, that's sounding... four. You're up. We've been playing so long, you're sounding more like my wife. I can't hear you. <laughs> wow. And yes, I was looking around to make sure my wife wasn't here to hear that. <laughs> Why should the allies have a two morale, Jeff? Yeah, I was trying to see this cavalry 45 degree turn. was definitely not at that one. Dang it, that sucks. I... What's that? I don't have any move that's consequential. Okay. I I don't have many either. Uh, I have, as a matter of fact, I think I have... Wait, your cavalry can attack, right? This group here. Yeah, yeah. No, I've got, I've got, I've got a total of. I have developed two other attacks. See, we can talk openly. Do it. It's all yours. About it. Yeah. So yeah, this have... one in the city, right? Yeah, right. The one you were thinking of. Yeah, I saw that. I saw that one over there. Nope, but not with him. <laughs> no. This is. Yeah. 
That's two more. I'm going to assume that we're okay to keep going. Yeah, what was your total so far? Um, Ron started out. I moved two. Yep. Ron had two, I had two, four, so it's five, six. We're at six. Yep. Yeah, you're still good. Okay. Ron, you want to let me keep going? Yes, sir. Jeff thinks we lost two units the last turn. That's why he thinks our morale should be down to two. Eight. Now he saw you move the cat, the uh, mobile artillery off your turn. Oh, that's, that's probably it. what's getting yeah, confused. Yeah, no, no, no. When when artillery runs out of ammo, it just gets removed. <laughs> yeah, and Hans says it'd be easier to to keep all the straight with with base colors. I'm sure it would be. Oh my god. That's, uh, starting to hey. Hey, but has you can charge somebody outside a forty-five degree arc? When did you come back in the room? The uh... <laughs> well, he, he was always in the room. He was just in the corner crying. Oh, okay, okay. So that was eight. Can I keep going? Yes, you may. You know the thing that sucks about doing this virtually. Hmm. There's no snacks. I mean, you, you can have your own snacks, but it's not like everybody can bring different snacks and share. Or we're waiting patiently. We keep, you know, we can't. Mm -hmm. Okay, like I want you eating snacks and touching my miniatures. I wouldn't touch your miniatures if I ate was eating snacks. Okay, you you've not been to Historicon. I can't even tell no. you. How many guys stand around a table with my freaking minis on them eating pizza, fries? One dude was eating nachos and licking his fingers and touching my soldiers. Oh, at least I'm twice I, next I, to me. I don't have I don't have miniatures, but even I know that that would be like a big uh, no no. Is it what the heck? People living like animals. Uh, that's ten. Can we keep going? <laughs> yes. I just want this COVID stuff to be over so we could go to a historic con or something so I can meet you guys in person. Yeah, no, I'm coming out. We're going to, Velker and I, we're going to get on a plane. We're coming over to Historicon, and we're going to hang out. That's what's, so? that's what's going to happen. Doug's coming. We're all, it's, it's a plan. We're going to Historicon. Right. That sounds interesting. Mm -hmm. All right, how about 12? Can I keep going? Yes. Yes, you may. Anything else worth a tinker's cuss? Tell me if you think I'm wrong, Ron, but I don't see anything. No, I don't see anything else of consequence. All right, let's see if we can win this game. Any gunfire? I think you got some, but I don't know. I do have. Matters. I have this guy. Horse artillery. Can't kill him. Can't kill him, but I want to fire him anyway. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Let me shoot him. Two. Uh, one. We'll go for the ten. It's, it's a one. No it's, it's more. It's moral imperative, right? Right. And I hit. Yeah, look at that. That guy thought he was going home safe. Wrong. Any gunfire? That I have no musketry. I have no musketry. Of course, of course, Ron just used up his one good artillery roll for Shut up. Saturday night. <laughs> no, it's just Knock it off. <laughs> Shut up. It's, uh, now it's going to be melees. Ron, do you want to do yours? Because this is a good one. Yes, I please. like this melee you built. That dude is Thank not you. in town. Uh, he's, he's just prepared. Okay. Five. So that's... I have ten. Because mine is one because of the river. Yeah, yeah. Why, that's accurate. 10 to 4, 5. 10 to 5. You got this, man. Woo. Come on. Come on, big roll. <laughs> I read what Tommy McGuire put in about counters. Six. <laughs> Gary Matson inside. Dave. He's yes. Five, five for you, sir. For you, sir. Five for me, huh? Okay. Six hits are facing you. Got a good shot of living. Oh. You don't. What you do? Oh. 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 Oh.
Oh, oh dear. I'm real sorry, guys. <laughs> no, what are you talking about? This has been a great battle. It's been a nail biter all the way through. When, 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 when you have a battle that finishes within five morale points of each other, yeah, it's a good you're battle. You're probably doing good. All right, so it seems like uh, Mike and I are going to have this one out. But this one isn't as pointed as the other one, but I still wanted to do it. Six. He's uphill. Ooh, six to s steady. S s yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, I take the minus one because he's uphill, so that's actually six. Five for me. Five for me. Seven for him. Ah, five to seven. I don't like Ouch. Those odds. I don't like those odds. Uh, you got good odds. You got what, two, Mike? Uh, uh yes. Yeah, yes. I, I know you beat me. So. Yeah, two to one. Yeah. Doesn't that don't matter so much? I nicked you. Oh, what? We have to go. I'm sorry. Goodbye. Oh, just line me up for my cavalry to hit you again. If you had another turn, that'd be great. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I am not going to dun you for being in this town. I just don't think that's fair. Um, so we'll just say that you are at a two. So yeah, you're at a two. And I am at a uh, seven. Seven to two. No hits for me. That's a kill. That's a kill. You're down to one. Here we go. This is it. I have confidence, Jim. I don't. The uh, <laughs> the uh, yeah. This is five. This is three. That is eight to seven. Eight. I'm sorry. Whoa. Eight to seven. No, he gets a minus for being in the town, well, right. don't he? He's not prepared. That's right. He is not prepared. Right. That's yeah. that's right. That is the choice he made. So yeah, he is at a minus. So he gets five four. So it's eight to four. He does not get the garrison bonus. Quite correct. Oh Quite correct. gosh, and oh. that means and that means he also has to re-roll all hits. Yes, because he's hitting from flank and the rear. Yeah. Eight to four. What about my study? That's why you're at four, not three. Okay. Got to play the BG, staying alive now. I got three. I got three. I think that's Ooh. a kill. You got more than three, didn't you? No, but I'm looking at the net. It doesn't matter, oh. though, because yeah. you have to leave. I take Prats in, and that is a one-point hit to your morale. That's yep. game. We did it, Jim. We did it. We did it. I can't we believe, did it. I can't we did you it. this out of the fire. can't believe you pulled this out of the fire. I owe Velker this fight, though. Yes. I owe Velker. This was an awesome last day. I mean, I came in late, but this was an awesome last day fight. I mean, it was close. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I was in no way sure. 5-4 uh, for me, and then another. And when you oh, texted four. me, yeah, the French are doomed. I was like, I've been there that's, before. That's seriously what I felt. That's what I felt. 5-4, so it's 8. 8-7. to 8-7, to seven, I re-roll all hits. You got how many? Three, four. Yes, three, four. I got three. Okay. Can I pull off all four? It would be Velkerish to do it. No, Velker. And I don't. So we would lose that fight. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is a French win at Austerlitz. As Pratzen falls, we gotta get him out of there by six by six inches. Oh. Yep. I just I just looking for the final shot. Way. All right, I gotta get a photograph. That's what I need. So, Pratson falls on the very last turn. Uh, the final morale score is four to nil. So, my goodness, what a what a fun deal! Um, Nail biter ending. <laughs> best kind 
uh, a huge thank you to to David, a brand new player and a brand new commander. I think you did a fabulous job. Fabulous job. I did my best. <laughs> yeah, no. You did very well, David. And um, you know, seriously, uh, always welcome back whenever we blue her. Pay attention in the farms, and uh, we'll be you know we got some other stuff coming up. Uh, what's coming up? Well, first of all, on Boxing Day, it wouldn't surprise anyone here to know that we'll be at Leipzig Part 11, starting at 1800 Central Standard Time. We'll be heading into 33 hours. We will finish Day 2, I'm confident of that, and we will have uh, what I call a restructuring day, as the Allies have to pull back a full 12 inches from all the French troops again, giving them a little bit of breathing space. We'll see what happens there. Also, throughout the course of the next week or so, because it is the holidays, uh, just stay at tips. Please watch the stream. Uh, we're going to jump on with some special stuff. Um, just some interesting littler games uh, and a few other, uh, a, a few smaller things. I have built, finally, as, as I've told John Stanley, we're going to have uh, cow pens coming up, but we're also going to have some uh, sharp practice. We're going to have some we're going to have some chain of command and uh, and all sorts of other good things. And in sharp practice, it's going to be both Napoleonic and of and uh, American Revolutionary War, American War of Independence. So a lot of different things. Uh, it's been great. You've been a, a wonderful group, obviously the players. But uh, it is. That was turn 28. That was the 28th turn. So uh, game over. Thank you so much to everybody who came with us to hang out. We always appreciate you. And to those who watch later, thank you so much. Please, I guess I don't say it. I'm supposed to say it if I'm any kind of a YouTube host. Please subscribe, like, and subscribe. We'd love to have you come back and, and hang out with us and do gaming. Last and certainly not least, uh, the Armchair Dragoons is going to be holding a virtual convention in January over the in America, the Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. holiday. Uh, I will be running two games on Saturday. Saturday at noon, I am going to, be, and that's all you nice United Kingdom people think about it, I'm going to be running a game of the men who would be kings, the Battle of Abu Klea, otherwise known as Remember Frederick Gustavus Burnaby. Um, and then in the afternoon, in the regular Saturday Night Fight slot, I'm going to be running the Battle of Bastogne for, or Baston, for Memoir 44, the uh, Overlord big battle version of Baston for Memoir 44. So some great introductory gaming. Uh, everybody, please sign up for the con if you can. You're more than welcome. And there's a, there's a ton of other stuff going on at that convention. Lots of other people. Uh, the Armchair Dragoons website has all the information. Please, please, please join us. And uh, yeah, let's see here. As has has a question about the victory. Nope. Uh, if morale breaks, we win. Uh, we win. Let's have a look. Yes, the very one. Right, but as, at the end has is trying to be wrong twice tonight. At the, but at the end of the game, what are you going to do? <laughs> it's the end of the game. The rules state: Where is it? Victory conditions. The French win by holding those things or by breaking the Allied morale before the end of the game, which we did. That is what happened. Which he's saying, which has is saying, which villages? Is it yeah, the villages these... were not used, were not determinative. Uh, the villages that he's talking about are here, here, or sorry, I started too far north, here here, here, and here. Uh, obviously, these four were in uh, were not owned by the allies. Ours are here, 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 and here. Oh, sorry, no, Bosnitz is one of them too. Where's Bosnitz? Where did Bosnitz go? It's up here, that's right. So it's here, 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 and here. That was my great aggravation with not being able to uh, seize cities with horse. Well, Red, this is your chance. This is it. This is it. We're opening up new things. Uh, check out Wednesday. 
I'm not sure what we're going to do next Wednesday. I have to get through Saturday. I have to get through the rest of the week. But yes, I will look. For, uh, yes, this is it. This is it. In you come. Because we finally cleared out some of the other stuff we were doing. Um, and wow, we did it in just a little bit over two hours. So, uh, my goodness. So, yeah, definitely check out the Armchair Dragoons forums if you're interested. I think there's some sort of a fee just because they use this ticketing service. I think it's three bucks for everything. So, three dollars American. Um, check it out. You never know. You might see something you like. We've got some board games. We've got uh, miniatures games. We've got seminars. And for those who are into Napoleonics, David Enstness is going to be teaching ESR live. Really? Yes. So if you if you want to learn how to play et sans resultat from the man who wrote the rules, you can't do better than this. Do it. Do it. Do it. He's a wonderful guy. Uh, he and I actually spent some time uh, late last week, I think, sitting down with Tabletop Simulator, and I sort of showed him how I build things. And so he is, I see him when I log into Tabletop Simulator fiddling away at a table. So I'm excited to see what he comes up with because he's an incredibly creative guy and a fun guy. And uh, he certainly loves the period a lot. Um... <laughs> he would have been correct in a normal game, but not in the scenario. He's going to call it a, he's going to call it a half a win. Yeah. So if, if you want to learn how to play uh, ESR, I can't, I can't, seriously, I can't recommend a better way. I can't. Um, I, and David and I have talked a bunch. We are also going to get together after Leipzig finishes. And he is going to, he's going to umpire a game. I'm going to play. He's going to umpire a game of Teugenhausen using ESR. So that'll be a multi-week game. And again, a, you know, come on and sign up. I'll put up a sign up for it when it's ready. Please just come up, sign up so I know who's coming. I know who to invite. And we'd love to have you. Anyway, I'm talking too much. Please, for those who are, never. Already, who are already in uh, who are already in Christmas Eve, enjoy it. May it truly be a silent night, a, a time of peace. We could all definitely use it. To all of you, uh, a Merry Christmas, if that's what you do. And if nothing else, uh, I hope you're someplace warm and with people that care about you because there's a lot of weirdness going on in the world. Thank you so very, very much. We'll see you for Saturday Night Fights. And in the meanwhile... Uh, from Felker and myself and everybody, please take care of yourself and one another. We'll talk soon. Yes, definitely, Ian. Bye, LaSalle.